My name is Finn Kruer and I'm the Chief Technology Officer here at Ninth Impact. Ninth Impact specializes on building games in partnership with TV franchises to build the official games for TV shows. We design unique game mechanics to capture what the fan base of a show loves about the show. We are currently working on Big Brother the Game, which is based on the most watched TV show of all time, Big Brother. Our approach to designing this game uh, was to think of a, a person's mobile device or PC as a portal into a massive uh, online Big Brother reality contest. Um, the player faces competitions, chores, nominations, evictions, and they have to navigate all the same complex uh, social challenges, social connections um, that make the TV show so compelling. Fans of Big Brother want customizable characters, characters that they can piece together, uh, sometimes they might want to make them look like themselves, sometimes they might want to look like a celebrity character from the TV show, or sometimes just a, a strange, funny, quirky character. A large part of the fun of the game is, is dressing up your character uh, in different clothes and different accessories as the day goes on. What we get with the Reillusion character creator ecosystem is the ability to create super high quality content, uh, both characters, clothing accessories, uh, clothing shoes, that is uh, fast to make, um, but still efficient um, for the application on mobile devices. This allows us to drop new content during the run of the game. Character Creator has a, a smooth export route to Unity and it's integrated with LOD tools that allow us to control the quality and the number of vertices for different platforms and also allows us to bake details into textures and to maintain that high quality look even at uh, lower, devi lower end devices. We had almost a million characters created in BBTG1 and we're just about to release BBTG2 and that number will likely increase dramatically. In the first iteration of the game we used our own internal character system and in this iteration we are replacing that with uh, Reillusion CC3 uh, system based characters. Um, you can see the obvious increase in quality. Um, meanwhile, we haven't impacted the size of the characters or the performance impact of these characters and their accessories and their clothing on the devices. The Reillusion CC system also makes it very easy for us to port our library of clothing, of accessories, of shoes um, into the avatar format so that they are straight away compatible with the characters um, coming out of Reillusion's own content library. This saves a huge amount of time and it lets the artists focus more on making more and interesting content rather than on solving issues around um, clipping or skinning problems um, like when the content is made say directly in, in Maya, Max or Blender. We wanted a, a host character for the game because the host is a very important aspect of the TV show and we used uh, actor core, actor library characters for this role um, they come, like all Reillusion CC characters um, do as well, with the um, blend shapes to allow for emotions and for lip sync, um, all while being of a, of a lowish vert count, which is it's compatible with, with our use case. Um, inside the game itself, then, we also use actor core animations. Um, such as the dances um, for players to use while they're in the house. Now that gives players a huge array of choices of different animations to use in the game. And again, it is um, much more efficient than developing all animations from scratch.